What's up everyone, it's Skid. This is going to be a video for Depressed in E2, and I have a cold. I just wanted to clear that up before someone started making claims that I was snorkeling asshole on mic, or maybe that somebody was forcing me to make this video at gunpoint or some shit, which is not the case. I was out getting wild and wet with it at a Christmas party, and I picked up a cold. But that will not stop me from spreading my moisture on the internet. Now, this is going to be a video for Destiny 2, and I play a lot of Destiny 2, and I'm not going to complain about the loading screens too much, but I'm pretty sure I could go to Walmart, crack a fart off, light that fart on fire, and then watch that whole big ass warehouse burn down in the time that it takes a Destiny loading screen to load. Now I've got on a Bygones, a Graviton Lance, and some big ass machine gun that I don't remember the name of. And right off the bat, I start shooting this guy. Now, the reason I use the Graviton Lance is because I think it's very good, and it turns people into purple blueberries. And I pop my super right here, and I walk out here, and I cast Deadeye. Jump around this corner, bam! Turn him into a pile of Cheetos. It's all over. But yeah, like I was saying, I really like the Graviton Lance, because when you kill people, it turns them into space blueberries. You watch this poor guy. Look at that shit, turned him into a bunch of little gobstoppers. And the weapon also just looks like it's been infused with a vaporwave, which is always worthwhile. And I see this poor guy here, he gets crowded to me, turn him into some Cheetos. Now I'm on the prowl right here, I'm out for blood. <laughs> Excuse me. I'm walking around out here, I'm fucking shooting everything. I try and cat hit this guy. I don't think I got the kill, but I did put a shot or two in him. Now watch this shit blueberries. It's incredible. Now those blueberries can hurt me, so I probably shouldn't have walked into them. This guy starts doing some fucking Darth Maul Jedi shit, and this guy blade brushes me, which was fucking just a wham-bam thank you, man. That was a two... That was a, a two-part plan. I get that guy right there, and for some reason I walk towards this guy with the sword with my gun. I don't know what my fucking plan was there. Maybe my accuracy would have been better up close or some shit. And so I walk through here and I pick up some purple pe Peter Eater ammo. And I'm ready to rock and roll now. I've got the big dick of God in my hand. Unfortunately, I do not have the aim of God and I missed about every shot on that guy. Luckily, someone killed him. I throw a grenade there just to keep that guy in that building. And I'm pretty sure, yeah, I melt that guy. Now, unfortunately for some son of a bitch, I'm in this Jesus ring so he can't kill me. So he got stolen of a kill, and I kill him instead. But the Jesus ring could not save me from whoever that guy was. Okay, so I start coming back out here. This guy's casting Blade Barrage like a dick. And I shoot that fucking Darth Maul impersonator again. Blocks my shots. And then the Nova Warp, which is just like someone who has embraced the power of the Graviton Lats, came after me. And so I come back out here with the Graviton. I see that guy catch some Adam Bay right to his face. And so I toss a grenade preemptively. It was not very effective, so I pop my gold gun once again. I come out here, and look at this poor sap. And this one too, look at this shit. Headshot him and take him out of his super. Felt just bad for the man. And look at that shit, I got some perfect taste. Guy Fury would have been proud of that kill. Now I fucking panic right here. This is a real shit show right here. I look around, I realize I'm in their spawn, so I try hiding in the rafters. Toss a knife into that window still to confuse them, and I cover my escape. And I come out here, and this is by far the greatest play I've ever gotten. Look at that shit, collateral. Shoot that guy in the ankle, insta-killed him. Now they may have taken me down with them. But I fucking gave them a run for their money. That was a three-piece. And that might not seem like much for some of you Destiny pros out there, but for someone who is shit like me, that was like getting taken to the Super Bowl. And not only winning, but getting to have sex with all of the cheerleaders all at once on the field. Now here comes a fucking Archmage of Winterhold trying to cast a Kamehameha at me. And <laughs> I fucking turn him into blueberries. This guy here walks up behind me. I know I had no chance of killing him, because he'd already shot me in the back like a dick. So I just put as much damage on him as I can. Or I could. And so I walk back out here with my Rudy Tootie Cowboy Shooty. 
And uh, right there, I got to taste the power of Chester Cheetah. Now, I did not kill that man. And look at the fucking score here. We clearly won, but it says defeat. And then uh, after the match ends, it shows that we indeed won. And I did very well. This was probably the best match of Crucible I ever played, which is not saying very much, but it meant something to me. And uh, yeah, that was a really good match. Now while this match that this is from was not all that impressive, this clip was, so I've decided to share it with all of you. I was just out here getting jiggy with it in Crucible when Edge from fucking WWE decides to spear me. And that scared the shit out of me, so I flipped a coin and it showed yellow like one of the two colors inside my pants during this clip. I walk back here, pop my super, and kill Emperor Palpatine, which causes Lord Shaquille to shit his pants. And hearing that got me pretty pumped up, but unfortunately Darth Maul found me. And though I made a valiant effort to kill him, he eventually found me and farted on my face. But luckily one of my teammates killed him somehow, so it's all good. It's all good in the neighborhood. Now this was a pretty good match right here. My team lost pretty horribly, and I wasn't even number one on my losing team, so clearly I'm in the 1%. So I walk out here, I get right into the thick of it, right into the action. I throw a golden snitch up there on that exit so some assholes can't flank me and get into my asshole. And I take out my titties here and show them to these two gentlemen who cannot handle their unholy light. So I just shit all over those two assholes. Then that man's asshole shits on me. And so I walk back this way. But right before I got killed, I killed that guy casting a Slova bomb with my gold gun, which I thought was pretty cool. I take the exact same route as last time because I'm fucking stupid. Then I throw another golden snitch and stab this guy in the dick. And he answers with a shotgun blast to my fucking head. So that means there's an acorn wienered wonder wandering the map right now with a kill on me. And me with no kills on him. That's not going to sit well with this jive turkey. And I see this guy shooting an inanimate object so that piqued my interest. I walked in here and this guy showed us his mystery meat. But not before I showed him mine and killed him with my gold gun. That guy back there is an efficient killer. I'm pretty sure he killed me three times in a row. That's the type of man to strangle someone with the ShamWow. That way he strangles them to death and then cleans up the blood at the same time with the ShamWow. That's a thinking man back there. And so I'm walking over here with my gold gun. I see that grape ammo disappear off the ground. Which raises my suspicions immensely and I see this guy. So I shoot him in his Nikes and I go over here to take his grape ammo. And once I've usurped his grape ammunition, I bust out my bazooka. And I see fucking Havestus over there running up the right side of that hill. So I decide to go try to back him up best I can with my Panzerfaust. And at this point right here, I feel like I've got the fucking power of God in my hands. I've got the big dick energy, the large penis spirit. But miraculously, I somehow managed not get a single kill. I blasted the shit out of the side of that giant black Rubik's Cube, but that's about all the offense I got put out with my power ammo. And so I walk in here, morale's pretty low, spawn's looking really familiar. So I say, fuck it. I bust out my old favorite weapon in the Crimson. This gun used to be my pussy. I used to use the shit out of this gun. And I walk over here and don't get anything done with my gold gun. And it's times like this that a man asked himself, would you fuck your partner on Naked and Afraid? True questions that only the soul can truly answer. But anyway, I walk back out here. I don't really get anything else done in this match. And I'm not going to lie to any of you because I think you're all big boys and girls and I think you can handle this kind of information. This guy here puts his fucking stinky pinky in my winky. Just absolutely fingered my asshole for me. But I really do not feel good. I've managed to take a lot of medicine and eat a shitload of honey so that my voice can hold up to do this video. But I do not feel very good right now. And the only reason I'm still recording is because a lot of people have told me they can't get their rocks off in the 5-6 to six minute videos. So I'm trying to record as much as I can. Now right here I fucking shoot that guy and save my teammate. But he squanders the gift and walks in there and gets his ass eaten for him right off the bat. And I'm just going to go ahead and fast forward through all of this because I'm sitting here in my chair drowning in mucus as I make this video. My throat's on fire, my asshole's on fire, and my nose is packed full of shit. But yeah, here's the end result of the match. As you can tell, I'm probably in the top three or four players in the world at this point for PvP skill. And yeah, 
That's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you have any more video ideas, remember to leave a comment down below. Special thanks to my patrons over on Patreon. And, uh, yeah, that's it for this video. See ya. Oh, I wasn't paying attention. It scared me. Skid. Fist fight. It's fist fight time. I've got- oh! Oh! You <laughs> killed him! <laughs> no! I'm sorry! <laughs> could you? Oh, could you? <laughs> <laughs>